Our immune system is our internal healing machine. So when our immune system's functioning well, and working well, we're well. We feel good. We're able to fight infections. We're able to uh, get away without too much inflammation. We just feel better. When our immune system falls off track, we get sick. It's as simple as that. Our immune system is made up of an army of cells that consists of things like natural killer cells, macrophages, t cytotoxic T cells, T helper cells. These are all white blood cells that are responsible as our first line defense when we're fighting pathogens or microorganisms, whether or not they're viruses, bacteria, fungi, yeast. There's a lot of external factors that affect how well our immune system is able to function. Proper nutrition is certainly a big key. Stress management, uh, sedentary lifestyles, mood, uh, our mental state, as well as our environment and toxicity. A combination of these factors usually determines how well our immune system is able to function. Most of the conventional treatments that work on affecting the immune system come into play after disease has set. So antibiotics, for example, are one of the mainstay medications, and they are possibly one of the uh, greatest discoveries in modern medicine. The problem is that with the overuse of antibiotics, because it is the main defense for the immune system, it's led to a lot of antibiotic resistant bacteria and a lot of viruses that mutate at rates that we can't fight them well. And so they've created a lot of diseases that our bodies are unable to fight on its own. We call them superbugs. Um, but antibiotics and, and antiviral therapy, they tend to be the main medications used. The tips to having a healthy immune system are the same tips that are there for general longevity and a healthy uh, cardiovascular system and healthy joints. It's good exercise, good nutrition, stress reduction, proper hydration. Uh, the combination of these things is what leads to a, a proper immune system.